A man is in custody tonight after the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office says he barricaded himself in his home following a domestic violence situation. It happened on Sun Pearl Court between Greenback Lane and Fair Oaks Boulevard in Fair Oaks. And ABC 10's Jeannie Nguyen was at this scene all evening to give us a look at what neighbors were seeing and how that incident finally came to a peaceful end. Now this scene behind me has been ongoing since five this afternoon and a spokesperson with the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office tells me that they were able to get the man outside of the house just after 830. I did speak with a lot of people who live in this Fair Oaks neighborhood and they tell me they're surprised that this would happen in a normally nice and quiet neighborhood. Very quiet, very nice, yeah. For nearly 40 years, Kirsta Burst has lived in this Fair Oaks neighborhood. But tonight, this is what she's seeing in her front yard. This is amazing, though. I've never seen anything like that. The Sacramento County Sheriff's spokesperson says this all started around 5 this evening when deputies responded to a domestic violence call. When deputies got to the scene, they found an injured woman and her child and immediately removed them from the house. The suspect was still inside and refusing to come out. From there, we contacted our SED team, which is our SWAT team, along with our negotiators. As the sheriff's office tried to get the man out, many people living nearby were standing outside their homes trying to figure out what happened. Yeah, this is a very good, good, safe community out here. Everybody's safe, usually. Everybody's watching everybody. So... Yeah, this is shocking that this ha happened today. As negotiators and SWAT teams continue to try to reason with the man, the sheriff's office says they were concerned he might be armed. He's got some criminal history uh, with some gun history, which leads us to believe that. We're obviously going to take every precaution. Making people like Bursch concerned about the children in the neighborhood. Not too good because I have kind kids and, you know, sometimes they're here. So uh, that's not a good idea, you know, to have a child here. But after about three and a half hours, the sheriff's office was finally able to safely bring a peaceful end to the night. The team deployed flashbangs and gas into the home, and fortunately that encouraged him to surrender peacefully. He walked out with his hands up, was taken into custody without incident, so absolutely the best possible ending we could have hoped for. At this point, the sheriff's office says that that man is facing charges related to domestic violence, but any other charges are pending the ongoing investigation.